Hey y'all, Decamon here, and welcome back to Bulger Skate 3. Last time, we made it to this lovely, lovely monastery in hopes of finding the Kretsch. Unfortunately, I didn't really seem to find much of a Kretsch. Instead, I kind of just got lost, wandered around, ended up solving a really cool puzzle involving a bunch of ceremonial weapons. It was a good time all around. <laughs> Uh, but anyway, today we should finally actually head to the Kretsch, and from the looks of it, it's down. So down it is, down to the bottom. I mean, we spent the entirety of last episode going up. Figured it makes sense that we go down for this one. My only concern is, you know, how badly I'm going to bone this up, which I hope is not too badly. I really hope it's not too badly. I don't want anything to happen to Lizelle. I'm sure Shadowheart's gonna hate my guts at the end of this, though. <sighs> That's just the way it's gonna be, I suppose. Oh, hi. We've reached the Kretsch. Lizelle says there should become a sign of device capable of removing the parasite. We just need to find it. But should we, though, is the question there. We've infiltrated, infiltrated. Can we call it infiltrated? We just kind of walked in. Like, literally, we just walked in, and I really don't want to get into a shit show and have to fight everyone in here. Send trace to arms! Istic, state your purpose quickly. Uh, Stand down, Gish. Is it not Vlacketh's command to welcome her faithful? I expected no visitors faithful or otherwise. Why have you come? Uh, allow Lizelle to answer. Yeah, I'm gonna let let uh let her deal with this. She said she wanted to. Uh, there's also this, but she did ask to she did ask to be the one to speak. So I'll let her do the speaking for right now. Seek the safest. Show me the way. You are infected. A gate thrall is something to eradicate, not reason with. Do we look like thralls? The faithful may be pure. This is Vlacket's protocol. Chuk. Fine. Let the Gustil carry out your fate. Report to the infirmary at once. And step carefully. Kreshia like watches you. Hmm. In an age, it is an honor. I would be more concerned and excited. Ardent Leon? Warrior. Ready to parry. Oh, interesting. Stop meddling where you aren't wanted, Istik. Ish. You may proceed to the crash. Well, thank you. I assume that's through here. Man, if these thing if this does go pear shaped, there's gonna be a lot of fights. They're making us join the patrol soon. The search must be going badly. Youths, huh? We are permitted to walk so free. Such a lack of discipline would be punished severely in Kalir. <laughs> Walk freely? This place is as tight as a patriarch's purse. You should have been disarmed on entry. And please be aware. It's strange. No doubt they found me too intimidating. <laughs> Classroom? I'm curious now. Are you now. here to learn from our He's so powerful. And wise. No wonder Vlack has put such faith in him. <sighs> a jockey. When you have a chance to kill your enemy, you take it. This seems a little harsh, man, but alright. This is only a taste of the mercy of Jake. A little concerned about inserting myself. We are training to fight Gake. You think they will hesitate? They won't need to if we keep killing each other for them. It's stupid. Orphy. Silence. It seems your childish prattling is attracting an audience. You fight again. This time, daggers only. And to the death, as instructed. Damn. Who wants to challenge this sniveling Istar? Uh, hopefully I can do this. With, <laughs> killing your own soldiers is not a strategy for when you go. Um, I am good at persuasion. God damn, a D10? Ooh. I'll 
I'll take what I can get here. Come on. Oh, yeah, that'll do it. That 18 is more than enough. I suppose your inane spewings have distracted enough from my lesson. <clears throat> Go wet the swords. I want them sharp enough to peel a geek's eyeball just by looking at them. I hope you prove as weak as this should we meet on the battlefield, Istik. Yeesh. I'm just trying to keep you from killing your own soldiers. You well on your way to being geek food. Do better. <sighs> All right, well... Sheesh, well, at least it kept the kid from killing himself. I get killed, damn. Now we just peacefully walk away before that friends wears off. <laughs> now is Tick wander our halls at their leisure. Captain Therizan will be even more irate than usual. Everyone in here is level five. <sighs> this imposing portrait depicts a powerful Githyanki warrior, undeniably regal in her mien. Is that their queen? Blacketh herself. She is both the sun that blinds us and the void that contains us. Praise be. In the corner of the painting is a small symbol you can't quite place. Hmm. Draw a new face onto the portrait. Inspect the symbol more closely. I might. I can try. I've got guidance. Ooh. Big bucks, big bucks, no lammies! Shit. Not even close. Ah, well. I'm not going to waste an inspiration on a, a history roll. Hard as you rack your brain, the symbol doesn't look like anything you've seen before. Yeah, it was worth a shot. This Githyanki looks different from the others you've seen here. She's got dark hair. The way her stark white skin stretches over her sharp features gives her a distinctly otherworldly aspect. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not doodling on the portrait, especially here in front of you know my lady mage hand you shove on traveler's chest the heck oh we're practicing our little psionics i see that's cute is there someone in there not now kachuki we're busy it's making an awful noise, yeah. <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? Uh, whatever it is, I think you should stop. It's clearly not having a good time. Mm, no. Hmm. Hmm, yes. Stop it. Let that thing out. Nah, we're having fun. Oh. Am I? Yeah, why not? I've got intimidation. Look here, you little shits. <laughs> yeah, that seven will do it. Fine. If you're going to be a big baby about it. A big ugly baby. Open it up then. It's all yours. <sighs> Would you mind? Yeah, that shouldn't be a problem. Nah. Like, it, it, it's it's insane how good Asterion is at this shit. <laughs> Your face, Kachoki. Oh, is that fine? There's a cat thing in here. It's just a Grimshaka. I'm like, like, why am I suddenly worried about a Grimshaka? Just... Uh, there we go. I was gonna say, is there gonna be an actual prompt there or is something, you know, gonna happen? You know what? Let's get close. Hmm. 
Well, that was interesting. Just weird cat thing, you know? You're not who I'm supposed to talk to. Men is stick before. Do you all look like that? Nah, we come in all sorts of shapes and sizes. Youths, youths. This is the infirmary. This crush's bunks look entirely too soft for my liking. <laughs> Jeez, Lizelle, what? You'd rather sleep on a rock? We found the Crutch Infirmary. We should speak about a cure. Hmm? The artifact. Uh, and guard inside the Crutch told us, uh, the guards at the entrance mentioned the captain. We should talk to these guards, find out more about what they're doing. I'll figure that out in a minute. Mind Flayer Parasite Specimens. Parasite, brimming with magic. Take it. Yeah, maybe not just yet. There's someone in here. There's a lot of them though. Parasite. Take it. It might be useful. Vertical incision from pineal eye to end of notochord. Intestinal coloration consistent with samples 231 to 259. Do you have a question? Or are you just going to stand there gawking? Uh. I'm a child of gift, not discarded rat flesh. Am I not due your respect? Perhaps. Perhaps not. Let the istic with you speak. And I will decide what respect you're owed. Hmm. Uh, what are you hoping to learn from dissecting that thing? Nothing your kind is capable of understanding. The better question is, what brings an istic to my infirmary? Hmm. I have a tadpole of my own. I was hoping you could remove it. My friend is infected. I'm looking for a way to help. <laughs> uh, I'm simply keen to learn, and you seem a favorable teacher. Oh, this should be an easy roll. Uh, not gonna stop me from guidancing it, though. Uh, we'll save friends for when I think I really need it. Oh, fuck me! RNG is an SOB! It's got it in for me! Better. I have no desire to teach, though your request is understandable. You do not gain true knowledge by demanding it of others. It must be earned. Let's see what knowledge your labors have borne so far. Tell me, what is your understanding of ceramorphosis? Ah. Stare blankly. Please explain it to me. I have first-hand knowledge. I'm infected. I suspected as much. Though I am fascinated that you've retained the ability to lie about it. You aren't the first istic to require my treatment. Though you are the most lucid by some margin. Either your tadpole is special, or you are. Mm. We must find out which. Oh dear. Go to the Sathisk. I will ensure you are cured. Huh. And the Zeth what will the Zethis do? It will relieve you of the specimen lodged in your cerebral cortex. What else? It will be worth it, I assure you. Hmm. You're very lucky, is Dick. Am I? Oh dear. Device is strange. Oh, Lazella approved. flesh and pockmarked metal. It waits for something. The Zathisk. Vlacket's purity distilled. My duty. My right. Hmm. Examine the device. I can try. Not the greatest of rolls, but, I don't know. Might get something. Nope. Nothing. The device is part organic, part synthetic. But you can't tell how it was made. Or how it works. Stand aside! 
My time has come. Go ahead, Lazelle. You've earned it. Praise Vlackith. Let it be done. I mean, she doesn't want the worm at all. Like, child, let the Zathisk end your suffering. The better question is, is this going to actually work? Probably not. Just waiting for what deus ex bullshit is gonna stop this thing from doing what it's supposed to do. God, that is bright! You must focus on the parasite at all times. The Zathisk will do the rest. Oh! Gah! I realize it was a bug. Blade cleaves your mind in two. Impossible pain sears your bones and body in concert with Lazelle's. Oh, perception save fail. Yes, child. Speak the Talakit. Meditate on its verses. You feel Lazelle's mind rip and rupture. Is this purification? Is this the cure? Ah, <sighs> plead with the doctor. Lazelle is in great pain. Endure, Lazelle. The cure is worth the torment. <sighs> Holy shit, that roll is atrocious. I need a crit or a... Bu no, not even fucking close. <sighs> no. I shouldn't have even tried. I didn't even realize the DC would be that high, though. No! Fuck it! Purge me of this blade! God, if this thing pops her head off, I swear I'm reloading. You share in Lazelle's agony. Every cell within her skull bursts into a constellation of fragments, sorted and reassembled. Lazelle will die if she remains. Yes, child. Jamar Zala Lakid called to your queen. <gasps> My queen, hear me! That thing's killing her. I know it is. Arrows. You sense myriad specters of Githyanki past. This is their fate. This is their anguish. Ah, <sighs> seek answers within the Zahith. What is this vision? Uh, you must listen. The device is changing you. You are becoming a lithid. Ah, oh, god damn it. Uh, I don't think she's gonna listen. We have to try. It's still a fucking thirty. Shit. Come on, dude. I want a back. I want a back. God damn it. Like, I literally can't- I can't succeed this roll without a 20. I am becoming pure! Yes, child. Face hope, Will. Your marrow quakes within your bones. Behind the pain, a new sensation rises. I'm trying! <laughs> uh, draw on the Zahik's power, take it as your own. Wisdom. Um, ah, my Arcana is actually the better roll here. Wow. But it's another fucking 30! How do you people expect me to do this? I can't remove her! Believe me, I tried! <laughs> but a 30! A fucking 30! The Zathisk overwhelms the both of you. The weight of the astral sea crushes your mind and spirit. Enough! Hmm? Oh! Okay, it's definitely not supposed to do that. Damn it all. The parasite. I still feel it. I am Githyanki. I will not be gay. My life's work, gone. And yet she lives, and so does her parasite. Her voice cuts with a fanatical edge, an obsession bordering on mania. If there's a chance the parasite lives, she wants it. Oh dear. 
Uh, I could try deceiving. The parasite lives, yes. Thank goodness. It saved her. Oh. It saved her. And it destroyed a Zathisk. Then its power is even more unique than I thought. I must examine it. Since the Zathisk did not extract it, we must resort to more traditional means. Uh. Wait here. I will gather my tools. Why do I feel like we should be gone by the time she gets back? I must be cleansed. That was too close. That's not good. I followed protocol. I kept to my faith. Yet the Zathis might have killed me. The gods still tampered with it. Traitor. And there may be more still. This must be why the Inquisitors come. Mm hmm. A traitor is a doctor? How can you be so sure? Are traitors so common? How about a thank you? It, I just saved your life. You were so close to a cure, fully you held on longer. Yeah, what makes you think the doctor's a traitor? Vlakith does not abandon Githyanki. The Zathis was tampered with. There is no other explanation. Now hurry. We must go to the Chirai and inform him of the doctor's sedition. Must we? Must we? The fuck is this? Not a Lloyd tank. Uh, I'm going to do something potentially stupid here. We, 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 we be stealing some items here. Should be another one. There it is. Alright, and then I'm gonna send these to camp. Right. I'm gonna send them to camp. Where the fuck are they? I guess they stopped eating up my normal inventory space at this point. She locked it. We attempted to remove the parasites using the junkie, but it failed and almost killed us. Our parasites must be very unusual. Huh. Lizelle believes the Zathic was tampered with his uniform, the Inquisitor at the crutch. We should escort her to him. Would you mind? Delicious. A crooked touch. Oh, Jesus. This is why Asterion gets paid extra. Have a lot on my mind and well. Oh no. Oh no. Why? Oh, don't tell me everyone in the frickin' place has gone hostile. Oh, do not tell me we fucked up. Do not tell me we already fucked up. I just wanted to talk! Damn it. Damn it, squared. Shit. Fuck. Oh. I hope Lizelle's still not going to be pissed at us for this. Can I nail that from here? Wow, that did nothing. That just straight up did nothing. Sometimes the only way out 
is through. And I don't like this idea. Actually, where's my other new spell? After all, I've got a brand new toy to play with. I might as well try it. I got fucking counterspelled? Oh, you little bitch. I got freaking counterspelled. Fuck me squared. Moving. Miss, really? <laughs> God damn, I just fell. <laughs> Well, the plus side is you won't be able to counterspell the shit I'm about to pull. Where's my... Spirit Guardians. Do Radiant. My character's down now. Oh, I have disadvantage right now because I'm poisoned, don't I? I've pretty much lost this. I have pretty much lost this. I don't think I should have unlocked that door. I straight up don't think I should have unlocked that door. It's all right. I'll lose this and then we'll just reset. Why, though? Like, just why? There. Got to focus. was my last spell slot, by the way. My dead last spell slot. Strike hard, strike fast. <laughs> Nothing important is ever easy. <sighs> I have no action. Damn. 
Leave me alone! I haven't done anything this entire combat! And there goes Asterion. Get up, buddy. Better. Victory awaits. <sighs> knock the fuck out of him. Now knock the fuck out of her. Get her off of there. What should I do? Knock her out. She's only got six health. Get him to throw a potion at us, and then actually wouldn't be too bad off. Oh, because he doesn't have a, a fucking turn. And down as well. Oh, he actually made a death save? Shadow Heart. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Looks like I'm actually going to make my death saves here. Yay. Damn it. Oh, did she die outright? Oh my god, damn it. You've got to be fucking kidding me. There we go. There it was. I knew it was gonna happen. Fine. We'll call this a load. From before, I stole the things. Apparently, if I open this door, I'm immediately fucked. Just, I cannot do that. I can't open the door. 
What else? I guess we just wait patiently for her to come back? That seems dangerous. Okay, so I had to ask my friend about this. I, I need to actually go back a little further uh, because if I can't convince the doctor that the parasite's dead, then the whole crutch is just hostile to me at this point. And that's just, that's a no-go. So, sorry guys, we're gonna have to redo this whole bloody section. Lucky me, lucky me, just what I always wanted. Uh, you know what the sad part is? Oh, I do have an autosave from coming into the crutch. That's good. That's good. I don't need to worry too much, but still sucks losing like 15 minutes of progress. All right, let's try, let's try pleading with the doctor this time. The safe disc is working as intended. Huh? I mean, we try this. Clearly this won't work unless I somehow miraculously roll a 20 in one of these. Oh my God! You're shitting me! And I even get a bunch of approval from everybody. Oh. Whoa! And it still explodes. What madness is this? The Zethus nearly destroyed me. I am Githyanki. I will not be gay. My life's work gone. And yet she lives. And so does her parasite. There's something in her voice that goes beyond rage. Curiosity, perhaps, or regret. Whatever it is, you cannot identify it. Ah, but I did the first time. All right, let's do the deception roll now that I, you know, know better than to fuck this up. Seriously. Uh, ooh, that's not a... For this, we roll advantage. Oh, or I could just roll another 20. <laughs> Nothing else matters. Really? Then all this destruction was a symptom of its power? <laughs> Incredible. I am disappointed that we could not extract it alive. It would have been an exceptional specimen. In any case, the problem is resolved. Leave me. I must salvage what I can. <sighs> no, it can't. Be. It can't. Ay, ay, ay. Well, at the very least, now I'm not like everything's getting super pissed at me. Save you once again. <sighs> All right, and now we can properly talk to her and do this again. I followed protocol. Yep. I kept. Someone must have tampered with it. An aberrance I can't begin to comprehend. Who could have tampered with the device? There must be a Sharlak in this crash. A traitor. The sort that is hunted, slaughtered, and erased from our histories. Mm. Few would dare dishonor their queen. Fewer still would be so brazen. Now hurry. We must go to the Chirai and inform him of the Zaphisk's tampering. Still have no idea how it was tampered with, but all right. Smoke rises. Okay. Well, at least this time I'm not, you know, constantly about to be hounded. The door's not locked. I'm not completely screwed. I can always come back and steal these later, which I probably will. All right. And we also know not to, you know, bug the poor kids. <laughs> As they throw around their weird cat thing. Yeah. At least this time I'm not being accosted and I don't have to fight the entirety of this goddamn place. That that would have been unpleasant. Oh, they don't mind if I take this. What's in here? Entirely too empty. The hatcher. Hmm. Seriously, you guys? Oh, we have traps around. I 
I mean, I'm sure these guys will get salty at me if I go near the eggs, so this is not where I want to be. I was just curious where the door went, that's all. Hatchery sounds like a place I sh clearly should not be. Youth, use. Where's this captain that they were talking about? That's the training yard. Hey, waypoint. That's good to find. Warrior and a, a traitor? has little patience for your kind. You'd better not waste her time. Ugh, blood, rust, scar. Is there no odious substance not smeared on this delivery? <laughs> I heard this plane was disgusting, but I didn't think it would be like this. <laughs> Sheesh. There must be something worthwhile on this plane or you guys wouldn't be here. Most metals here fold like istics, much like istics themselves. But if you're so keen to extol their virtues, you can pay accordingly. Yeesh. <laughs> and yet I get a de- <sighs> Well, I don't think I'm getting a discount. Uh, what have you got? Defender flail. That's not bad. Well, first things first, let's get all my wares out of my inventory. What else do you got that's worth a darn? A plus one hand axe, plus one rapier, ooh. And it's got, and it's got a D4 of Radiant? Oh no, the D4 of Radiant is on us right now. This is just a plus one rapier. Plus one longbow, witch breaker. You gain advantage on attack rolls against concentrated creature. That's cute. The Unseen Menace. This weapon is invisible. It loses this property for two rounds on a missed attack roll, and yet it's still plus one. Hmm. A short sword, a light crossbow plus one. That's not terrible. So I definitely want that. Lairton's Wrath. It's a plus one, but it's got a unique ability. Razor Gale? Huh, that's cute. Just a longsword other than that. That flail's not bad. A uh, better question. Can Shadowheart use it? Yes, she can. And that's much better than what she's got. These guys sell off their wares too. Now that she's got a little more gold in her pockets. Whoa. Where did this pop up from? Uh, Knife of the Undermount King. It's a short sword. Reduce the number you need to roll crits while attacking by one. This effect can stack. When you roll two damage or less, reroll taking the highest result. You have advantage on attack rolls against obscure targets. It's a plus two, two, damn. Uh, it is a finesse weapon, so I could give this to Asterion. He's he's a little weaker being a D6, but God damn. That is a frickin' house of a weapon. Oh, I haven't even looked at these yet. Uh, when the rear cross, oh, they gain 10 in per hit points. That's not bad. Daredevil gloves. The wearer gains plus one to spell attack rolls. Shit. This effect can be toggled off. That's, that's really good. since I'm not really wearing any half-decent belt. Uh, and then there's gl just plain gloves of dexterity. Set the wearer's dex to 18. Plus one to attack roll. Shit. Madame, you've got some good stuff. That dagger, man. That dagger's not cheap. Or short sword, I'm sorry. It it's not bad. Don't get me wrong. 
I don't know who would use this though. Maybe me. Then again, these gloves are actually really good. Especially since I use spell attack rolls, so let's grab these two items. On your way then. <sighs> My word. So much sass. So much sass. All right, now where are those gloves that I just picked up? Not the sparkle hands, the daredevil gloves. You remember that story? And those booties. Since I do use concentration spell. Oh, oh. Oh, I don't have, oh, fuck me. I can't use these. Well, that's disappointing. See, that's what happens when you don't check shit like that. I don't have medium armor proficiency. <laughs> I can't use these! Well, I feel really stupid all of a sudden. What am I to do? On the plus side, uh, I can swap this for this. Actually helps our armor too, which is kind of cool. That's a bonus, it gives her extra armor. Huh. Makes her tanky. Hmm. How to track an illithid? Well, I'm... I don't know how I track an illithid. I imagine the answer is very carefully. Oh, it's locked. Okay. Alright, didn't know it was locked. Interesting place, interesting place. At least I've managed to pick up a couple of, you know, halfway decent items. Kind of reminds me of the, uh, uh, the cultist base. Please, Chitrai, I can explain. The latest batch of cultists knew nothing of the Astral Prism. They were just trying to find Moonrise. They all head there. My Gish have drafted plans to assault the tower. They are ready to fight, Chitrai. We could sift the missing artifact from the tower's ashes if you would give us... Quiet. Find the Astral Prism, Therizin. My patience falters. Yes, Chitrai. You heard him. Go! Do as she says. She remains your Kithrak. For now. Damn. Something tell I don't like him for some reason. Oh. I'm not here. Speak to the captain. Let's see how well she handles this. Interesting. Oh. We have big doggies. An istic in my crash. You are one of the mercenaries sent to bring the weapon. The Istic is with me, honored Kithrak. So noted. But my question goes unanswered. Do you bring the weapon? Ooh. Don't tell her anything. Hmm. Uh, there's a Mind Flayer invasion in progress. Why is that not your priority? Oh. <laughs> Uh, I seek audience with your Inquisitor. There's a traitor among you. He speaks the truth, Kithrak. A Sharlak. Among us? Whom would you accuse? Uh... Is it the Doctor? Is it Voss? That is only for your Inquisitor to know. I don't know who it is yet. I don't know who it is yet. Hmm. 
vague allegations and undue demands. A poor introduction for an unproven istic. The very same said to hold the weapon we seek. Oh dear. Shema is Allah Give it to me. Uh, all right. No, no. Oh, damn. She just literally mind yanked it. There it is. Exactly as described. The Inquisition will finally come to an end. Uh. Oh! I guess it doesn't like you over me. Heresy! How did you. Don't ask me. You manipulate it when I cannot? You presume a lot. I have no idea how this thing works. Forbidden to leave. Report to the Inquisitor at once. Deliver the prism. Do not try to leave, or it will be your death. Oh. Fair. I assume this way is to. Oh, I got experience for that. Uh, Lazelle believes the Zathik was tampered with as he could inform the Inquisitor. We should escort her to him. Is that it? I guess so. The radar suddenly turned red. I assume that means if I, you know, screw up, they're all gonna turn on me. This place is even more foreboding than the rest of the crash. I'll breathe easier once we're gone from here. <laughs> I'm more worried about this this inquisitor do you really think he'll help us mm. it's never been that simple before i don't know why it would be now Actually, what is it this is oh never mind that's not wares that's not wares that's alchemy That's the case. Let's just uh, do some extracting. There we are. Suddenly get a whole new buttload of recipes. I can make animal speaking. I can make potions of flying. <laughs> oh, wizard's bane oil. Cool. It's nice that you can just make potions. You know, assuming you have enough stuff. I do hope I don't get into any major fights in here, because, uh... I don't know what the hell I would do. <laughs> Crew's a little out of slots. At least Shadowheart is. I imagine... Yeah, I can't even go to camp to long rest at this point. Knock, knock. Inquisitor's Chamber. Well, if I get into a shit show, this is a hell of a... Esteemed guest, please approach. We have much to discuss. My Arden spoke of one of our kin that escaped a crashing Gake slave vessel. Try. Vlacketh's justice in flesh. You have accomplished much, child. I am pleased to finally meet you. And now he's all smiles. There is so much goblin blood on your hands that it soaks their children's nightmares. To business. I suspect you plucked something precious from the Gake ship. Something that belongs to us. Eh. The weapon. Give it to me. I don't know. The last one I tried to give don't it to, it didn't it. work. The weapon is how I protect you. Oh. Do it. Do not disobey the Inquisitor. Uh, I can give it to you, but I don't think you'll like it. Uh, should you be more concerned with the Mind Flayer Invasion? How do you know so much about me? I can't. It protects me. I can give it to you, but yeah, I don't think you'll like it. <laughs> Perhaps you should leave the thinking to me, Istik. Hand over the weapon. Uh, I, I realize this is probably not going to work. Like, I, I imagine just like before, it's just going to yank itself back into my hands. But I'm very curious. 
No. I so mean, it is found. Discover the artifact secrets. No. Oh, hi. Vlakith Gorg Skathzai. My queen. Skathzai. You are permitted to look upon me. You are invited to kneel. The Deathless Queen has spoken. You will obey. Uh. I imagine, you know, I'm, look, when you're fucking with gods, you, you bend the knee. All right, for right now, I'll, I'll take the knee here. These attendants you keep, you taught them well, my child, my laser. Chma Zala Vlaketh, you know me. Erlon of Kalia speaks most highly, as did Archaia before. You seek purity. I may yet grant it. Oh. Istic, you bear that which is ours. But are you friend, or are you thief? Look, at this point, I'm happy to say friend. I didn't take the weapon from you, but I am returning it. I'm the hero who found your weapon. Neither, it's mine by right. Uh, I don't know. You know what? Bitch deserves a bit of an attitude. Your utility is proven, but your heroism is yet to be witnessed. A test, then. Oh? To see if you are as capable as you profess to be. Fair enough. That weapon you carry. The Astral Prison. It is corrupted. I will cleanse it for you, my queen. Tell me how. There is someone inside. Their mind is warped. Broken. A blight! They are an agent of the Grand Design. Sent to sabotage the Astral Prism. Our last defense against the return of the Elithid Empire! I imagine that part's wrong. As long as they live, the prison is compromised. Kill them! Do this, and I will cleanse you and your allies. Do this, and ascend! Ascension? My queen. An honor gained. A burden born. You must accept, refuse, and you will know my fury. Ah, fuck. Ugh. I can't do that. The person inside protects me from the absolute. I mean, they're kind of useful at the moment. You are being lied to. I will be obeyed! Skvar, do not defy my queen! Ugh. Crap. God, did I walk into the something I really shouldn't have? Oh, God. Oh, uh, crap. I don't know. Fuck me, I hate having to make tough decisions like this. Perhaps I misheard. You would not speak ill of a god, would you? Do not test her. She will be our ruin. <sighs> I spoke too hastily Obey, just for you. my child, and be forgiven. Use the Planecaster's power to enter the artifact. Be wary of the creature's lying tongue. Cut it out if you must. Rewargas? They are not to leave until it is done. As you say, yeah. my queen. Chma Zala Vlaketh. We will not waste a second. All right. Well, I hope this didn't end badly. I hope I really didn't just screw the pooch here. 
Um. Oh. I say something actually supposed to happen. God, that guy has so much health. The plane caster. Don't do it. Are you sure you want to enter the astral prism? <sighs> well, guys, if this go ba goes badly, I love you, Asterian. The rest of y'all, well, it was fun. <laughs> Your mind burns hot with excitement. I really hope I didn't just completely screw myself. Whoa. Oh yeah, this is where we keep seeing our dream visitor, so she's from the astral plane, huh? Is she stuck in here? Or is this thing just basically her radio for us? A timeless space, bounded, compressed in a fold. A pocket of astral plane. Hmm. Boundless. Timeless. Like every dream that ever was stitched together. It is home. Oh, so they're astral denizens natively, huh? Astral gravity. Where the f Well, well, well. Where have I ended up? Gravity on the astral plane is different than that of Faerun. The affected entity is immune to jump and jump distance is tripled. Holy crap. You kidding me right now? Oh fudge. Fly! Yeah, we literally can just fly. Hang on, there's stuff around here. Beckoning cave. As in, this is where I'm- oh yeah, this is the person I'm supposed to- You'll forgive me if I don't do a little bit of uh, looting and scooting while I'm in here. You know? Divine Bone Shard? Oh, Elixir of Universal Resist- fuck that. Oh yeah, shit, we're taking that. I mean, I'm here, there's no reason not to take a few items. It's not like any of this stuff- not like I'm gonna have another chance to get any of this stuff for, you know, ages if ever. So I will take every last opportunity I can to pick up some weird resources around here. Oh, the slate's faded symbols are hard to distinguish, let alone decipher. The drawings etched underneath them, however, are plain to see. They depict a dragon soaring above two individuals, one standing tall, the other kneeling. A circle is drawn around them, a fuzzy tail trailing behind. They are riding a comet. Aww. Uh, actually, we'll bring that with us. Here we are. Well, that seems to be everything of actual value around this little area. Oh, nope, missed a couple weave moss. Can't have that. We will talk in private. Just the two of us. Hmm. Alright. Just the two of us, huh? I may have made a mistake trusting you. Well, I still don't know who you I are, told so. I you to stay away from the Githyanki. But you just couldn't help yourself. Could you? Eh, curiosity, my ma'am. Hmm? Is she gonna talk, or...? Alright, well, still, refusing to get Yankee Queen's orders, that was bold. You are a worthy ally. Alright. Valketh told me you were an agent of the Illithid Grand Design. I imagine this is full of shit. 
<laughs> I told you I stole the artifact from someone. Well, I stole it from Blackith. Since then, she has become desperate. Blackith wants me dead because I know her secret. Mm -hmm. It is a secret so great that if her people ever found out, that would be the end of her rule, the end of her. That same secret is how I've been protecting you from the Absolute. I can hear your thoughts. You think I'm lying. Blackith warned you that I would try to deceive you. But consider this. What reason have I to deceive you? I want the same thing as you. Freedom. Hmm. Interesting. I'm on your side. I have been since the very beginning. To be fair, you have been very helpful. Oh. Uh, Vlacketh be damned if she wants you dead, she can kill you herself. Is this some sort of trick? I'm sorry, I don't want to do that. No, <laughs> nope. I told Vlacketh I wouldn't kill you. I meant what I said. Get up. It seems I was right to put my faith in you after all. Thank you. Heck with that. I don't need you killing yourself. Vlacketh will be furious to make no mention of your Githyanki companion. The Lich <sighs> Queen fears nothing more than the loss of her empire. The knowledge I have of her deception will bring that about. Hmm. Valka's a goddess. What could you possibly know that would bring down her empire? Godlike in power, yes. But with none of the sanctity. Vlakith is lying to her people. She pretends to know how Gith destroyed the Mind Flayer Empire. In truth, she knows nothing. Oh. If the Illithid Empire were ever to return, she would be incapable of stopping them. And if her people found out about her impotence, there would be mutiny, revolution, the end of her rule. Ooh. That's not good. That very power, the power to resist illithid control, which Blackith only pretends to know, is how I've been protecting you. I suppose she hoped to extract it from my corpse. Since you spared me that fate, she will come for you. Huh. <sighs> I protect my allies. As do I. I have delayed long enough. The next attack is overdue, and I can't risk you being caught in the middle of it. I need you out there, searching for the Absolute. You were on the right path to Moonrise Towers. Return to it. To you Moonrise, are. huh? The Inquisitor awaits your return from this place with orders to kill you. No doubt the rest of the Kresh will join him. Good luck. Oh, god dang it. So I'm gonna get hostile to the place anyway? Have you killed my queen's enemy? Uh, I'm not going to kill them. They protect us from the absolute. Uh, actually, I learned a few things. Your queen is lying to you. Hmm. Uh. That's not good. Vlakit does not lie to her faithful. Open your mind. Show me. All right. Your mind you asked for it. Awesome. Lazelle seeks entrance. All right. Open your mind, let Lazelle in. Your thoughts become one. She sees the truth of your confrontation in an instant. Blacketh Tafkinazin. I see only... only madness. Blacketh bears the full might of Tunarath's arms and the covenant of the great mother Gith. We must go to the Chirai. He will summon Blacketh. She must know of this, this apostate. Interesting. Oh boy. Oh, is that my exit? That looks like my exit. God, are we gonna really get into a pissing match the moment we leave this place? If that's the case, oh dear. I don't know if we can win that fight. Crew is not in the best of shape at the moment. Lazel, I've been waiting. You are named Hashalak. Bend your head, for my blade is ready. What? Right, please, summon Vlaketh. There's much- Irrelevant, geek wretch. The queen has spoken. Your death is decreed. 
You realize what Lazelle doesn't. Whatever the outcome of your visit to the Astral Prism, Vlakith had no intention of letting either of you live. Ah, shit. All right, well, suddenly this just turned into a fight. With me. Great. There's a good amount of people in here. Oh, hi, Asterion. Of course, I don't have any way of getting any sort of gags, do I? Can't be cast outside of combat, that's fine. What are the odds this actually works on anybody? 25, 35... Target is out of sight. Or the others. 35. Hmm. What else have I got? I mean, there's hold person. I imagine this is, yeah, this is pretty much the same success chance. Anything that's going to require a save, that's, that's their save. Goes is ready to parry bullshit. This group is not going to be easy. Attention. This is going to be a tough fight. Mind steel link. What is this? Being drained receives a minus two penalty on its armor class and is vulnerable to psychic damage. Condition only offends when the affected entity damages the guy. Okay. Well, if that's the case, we can deal with that soon enough. First off. Damn. Give me that action surge. We gotta get the we gotta get some people down here. Nice action surge. Perform five attacks in one turn. Your enemies won't know what hit them. Literally. Uh, I don't need that just yet. I'm not encumbered, am I? Hope not. All right, let's go. I will want me a spirit weapon. Better get to it. guys do like wasting their spell slots. Alright, there goes the rally. Damn, that's with that? Jesus, that hit hard. Ugh, took 
took no damage. Of course not. They've already gone. I just need to start removing people from the board here. Alright, problem solved. that. Talk to me. God, this guy has so much health. <laughs> and my crew can't land a fucking blow on him, of course. Alright. Would you mind landing this, please? There you go. Now you're not being dealt with that bullshit no more. I got a big potion? Yeah, grab a big potion. Finally landing some good shots. Oh, hi. Your life is over. Come on, Salah Vakif. Way too much movement. She doesn't have any. Well, she could misty step her ass right up there with him. Ooh, good crit. Good crit. Ah, he made the save. Goes that one. Still on my feet. There you go. Get down there, you little bitch. Oh, he's like, no, I'm up here again. Good crit. Hit him again. Let's finish this. I'm ready. Ha! <laughs> Gotta love that hex. your senses. Now leave before the others come for us. <sighs> Vlakith. I have wielded your fury as a blade, roared your wrath as a dragon. Yet I crawl among my own people, low as an asp's belly, 
Skagath! Is this to be my penance? Is this heart of stone doomed to shatter? Oh my goodness. I kind of feel bad for her, actually. She tests me. A trial of faith. Kalir prepared me. Only the heaviest souls soar to the astral. Yes. Yes. I might gain Vlaketh's favor yet. Oh boy. All this and you still stand by Vlaketh. You're as dull as you are, stupid. An impressive show of faith. Will it be enough for your queen? You're an enemy of your people now. You need to accept that. Silence. I must think. <sighs> She's going to be a while. Wow. My man had some stuff. What is this? Potion of angelic slumber? Drink to fall into a two-turn slumber. Unless interrupted, you gain the benefit of a long rest. What? That's bonkers. And then there's these Githyanki greatswords, which are just straight up D1 or uh, plus one greatswords. Uh, what is, what does Lizelle have on her right now? That's a good question. Oh, enough waiting. I crave blood. You've got a plus one great axe, which is a D12. Is that better than 2d6? The 2d6 is more reliable, but at the same time, the uh, the d12s are better for the crits. And there's this. When you succeed a saving throw, the foe that, that caused Githyanki and oh well, now yeah, she's just gonna uh, equip that. Oh well. Githyanki short sword. Just strain plus one door short sword. Okay. What is this? When you inflict a condition, gain arcane synergy. Uh, that actually can go to. Uh, that can go to me actually. What is this? Just, oh, just robes. That can go to camp. Food goes to camp. So what's the plan here? We just gonna have to storm our way out after all? I mean, I kind of was trying to avoid that, but clearly that's just gonna be how this goes. It's the plane caster again. And I cannot rest. I assume that means I also can't tell, you cannot fast travel from this area. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Like, I am just straight kind of fucked. Those are alchemical ingredients. The skin burster? Uh, they gain two turns of force conduit. Uh, just by one per turn remaining. It's even it's five or more remaining. Oh, that's cute. It's not bad. Gold and ingot, bark skin and arcane cultivation. All I wanted was to get a worm out of my head. I didn't sign up for dimensional travel and murderous gift. Hey man, it's just all part of the show. It is literally just all part of the show. Elixir of the Colossus? Oh, used to increase your size. That's cool. Uh, that's gonna go to Lazelle, actually. this. When one of your cantrips deals acid, cold, fire, lightning, or thunder, add your spell casting. That's cute. Not useful on me, unfortunately, but useful nonetheless. Huh. 
That sucks though. My poor crew here is just kind of beat up and I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it out of here in one piece or not. And on that note, uh, that's going to be it for this one. <laughs> this has kind of been a rough episode. Hmm. Anyway, if you've enjoyed this, please leave a like and favorite and subscribe to join me for more insane tabletop action. And as always, I'll see you in the next video. Wish me luck because this thing is going to be rough trying to get out of here. Place your heart.